Hey, what's going on? So a couple weeks back, I uploaded a video about the Ziva ZRT, which is pretty much a realistic facial animation that you can use in the future. So they did have an update for us. Now they are starting to hand out access to this, beta access to this tool. But after talking to a couple of people who received the access, apparently it's just a project with this facial animation in it. So it's not actually the tool that you can use to create the facial animation. So I'm kind of confused. Uh, if you have the access, uh, let me know in the comments below and so we can kind of talk about this because I haven't received it yet, unfortunately, but I'm hoping I can get access to it so I can play around with it a little bit. But here's the updated video they uploaded a couple of weeks back, I think. So let's go ahead and check it out and we'll talk about it a little bit more. Help the woman get back to her feet. The soft cushion broke the man's fall. A pot of tea helps to pass the evening. Was she just naturally sloppy about everything but her physical appearance? The box was thrown beside the parked truck. Is a relaxed home atmosphere enough to help her outgrow these traits? Special task forces rescue hostages from kidnappers. The girl at the booth sold 50 bonds. Sorry. <laughs> Rice is often served in round bowls. Yeah, so as far as I know, this is actually the access that they give you. It's just the uh, the video inside the Unreal Engine 5. So I'm not quite sure if that's true or not, but I did talk to a couple of people, like I said. But this is, again, insanity, guys. This is just crazy, right? So obviously, she's a facial mass CG character inside Unreal Engine 5, and this is what really excites me. Even though I'm probably not going to be able to use this tool and purchase this because this is probably going to cost a lot of money. This is probably going to be so far away from my reach that I'm never going to use it, but it's still so cool because give it five years, give it 10 years, and I'm probably going to be able to use it then. You know, it's going to become cheaper. One day, this is probably going to be in your iPhone. Something that you can use with your iPhone app or something like that with AR kit and that just to think about that That is insanity. The last video I uploaded I had a couple questions like people were asking how they were doing this So I'm gonna show you a real quick uh, video they have on their channel on how this process kind of works as far as capturing the face Okay, so here's the video of that Ziva ML face, which is their solver. Uh, the right side is actually the real talent and the left side is the CG character and let's go ahead and press play this type of virtual human interactive face performance can only be executed with real-time software from Ziva Dynamics. All right. So according to Ziva in their information, you're going to be able to do this real time with one millisecond delay, which is insane. And you can uh, also achieve this facial animation using pre-recorded uh, video, kind of like what you're seeing now. And again, that's crazy, man. Like this right here is just mind blowing to me. I mean, obviously I grew up playing video games and you know, grew up watching CG characters, but this right here looks really, really good. Uh, comparable to like 4D animation that I've been seeing lately in the Matrix demo and Face Goods demo on their LinkedIn. It's pretty crazy. I mean, this girl right here on the left actually has a lot more detail than the real character on the right. And what's crazy is what if the real character is actually on the left and they just put a bunch of markers on the CG character on the right. Hmm. Yeah, I just start, kind of start thinking about this now, right? Because look at her lips right here. She has a lot more detail on her character than what we see here. So the question is, who's really real here? The left one or the right one? But yeah, anyway, this technology is insane. It's going to be very interesting. The catfish game, like this is going to affect catfish game if you don't know what a catfish is it's pretty much like you meet somebody online and they talk to you and they kind of date you and you guys are like boyfriends and girlfriends online this is gonna make catfishing so much harder because before you know you get voice and text but now if you have somebody that looks like this facetiming you asking you for money man this is going to be incredible and it's going to be crazy and I'm so excited to see what people are going to do with this and actually I can't wait to get access to this and as soon as I do, I'll play around with it a little bit more but yeah. And lastly, thank you for 46,000k subscribers. At 50,000 subscribers, I am going to be giving away a motion capture device so go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you want that.